that's where we start our work so if some one task came now and the task is for okay so now incident you all know okay tasks came okay task number one okay create a group task number two okay create a cat item new cat item task number three okay add user to group task number four very carefully understand this one more this is very important point okay uh, now you these four tickets came to our queue service now platform support queue okay now if you are belongs to service now platform support team what do you exactly do here tell me first one how you handle everyone just to think and tell me please based on your current knowledge i assign you this particular task what you do Mm, tell me everyone understood my question you all understood my question so if i assign this task to you okay i am a team lead okay you are all my team members i assign this task to one of the person you are all the one of the person now what you do if i assign this task to you maybe we can and we will create the group where you will create the group sir we will uh, no, we will assign that uh, task no, to wait. our name please wait where you create the group no? means in which instance please repeat ma no? your answer is right only where you create the group a group table group table in which instance Dev. Okay, you create in Dev. Then you close the task. Huh? So you okay? So I assign this ticket to you. Okay, you went to Dev. You created the group, and then next step what? Complete. Please complete this entire thing. So what you do? The task is assigned to you. You went to Dev. You created the group. Then next what? Please. Continue. Right? Another way we can continue, Mark. Don't scare. Continue, please. So, continue. so what we can do is we can just create one template, template. so user can create their own group with the details. Who is the user here? user don't have access to create a group now why they will raise a request if they have access to group creation okay so other other please answer if this is the requirement if i assign this task to you people what you do sir on dev we will create the group mm -hmm. you, uh, you create a group in and dev, then yeah then uh, group I mean, group record is not going to save an update set, so we need to move. Uh, I mean, for moving to test, we need to move the XML mm, okay. of the group. Mm. So good. Via XML, you move the yes. group to test. Very good. Then next test. Yeah. So once yeah. So yeah. So once we move the XML to uh, I mean, uh, to test, then we will. Uh, Perform a testing on test. What testing is needed here? Uh, then once we for group creation, what? Testing yeah, uh, we need to check in. Yeah, sir, we need to check in the uh, group table. Hmm. I mean, uh, the group record is created or not hmm. on test. Hmm. And then, uh, then yeah. once we exported means it came. Okay, so you just validate it. You go to group table and then just check whether the group came. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Then next step is what? Yes. Then, sir, once we got the approval, I mean, if what the approval? testing is, I, I mean, once we validate, 
I mean, once we got the val, I mean, validation. I mean, uh, after validation, we can move the same way to production. Hmm. So get the same group in I mean, production also. We, Very good. Then next what? No, what step now? Yeah. Next what? You yeah. Do? Then in production also in. Yeah, in production also in group table we need to validate that this group is exported or not. Very good. Next. So the yeah, this. Next. Uh. Uh. Next. Uh. And I'm not sure if what next. Sir. So did you close the task or did you just open the task as it is? Oh okay okay. Uh yeah. So once it is moved to production, then we can uh, close the task. Hmm, simple. Okay. Everyone understood. Everyone understood, ma. Whatever we come with. <laughs> so, small adjustment here is once the task is assigned to me. Generally, how we do in live is we create the group in production directly, and then we export that XML to test and dev if needed. We we will do in reverse because we can't wait. Okay, just create a group and then close the task. And if the group is needed in dev and test, we export it. Simple. Understood, my everyone. Yes. Yes, sir. So directly we can yes, create sir. the uh, group to production. Yes, we can create it. Okay. We can do it. Okay. okay. Now second one. Okay. Sir. Ah. So okay. Next the second one. Okay. Access to. We will be having access in the production also to operate user administration, group administration. Now we means our ten people. Okay, good. Now second task. Okay. If I have given this second task, what do you do? Everyone, next next person, anyone please. Not from these two. I think uh, two people who spoke is Anusha. Well, I think Anusha. No? I I her name is Anusha. By the way. And Joshna Var, I think correct. Anusha Chaudhary and Joshna. Am I right, ma? No, sir. First one is. To he na. Ah, no, sir. To he na. Okay. So accept these two remaining people. If this is the ticket, then what you do? Please don't waste the time. If you, anyone. Hello. Yes, ma. Yes, sir. So first, I'll create one catalog item hmm. in SC underscore cat underscore item table. Hmm. Then and after that, I'll define the variables. Where you create? No? Cat item where uh, you create? No? What are variables? Catalog item where you create? And Dev instance. Uh, so filter navigation. Service. In which instance, ma? Please. In which instance? Dev. Is that Dev instance? So before that, okay. Very carefully, see. I I'll cover it, okay? So here, create a story first, because it's a development. For first option, there is no development. It's a data directly data. Anything that needed a update set or it needed a development, it needs to start with story creation. Okay, and then dev. Okay, complete the development. What you develop here? Catalog item creation, variables creation, all the flows, all the things, workflow, everything. Okay. So dev job, then move to test, move to prod, and then close the close the story, and then close the task. Understood, man? Now, everyone. Yes. Okay. Yes, sir. Now third one means story first, sir. Story first, sir. We have to close story first, yes. Okay. In live environment. We will make some logics. I will tell you the logics later. Okay? When we can create a story from task only via UA policy, UA action, and we also build one business tool. Say when story is completed, if the story is originated from task, close the task also. It's just a simple business tool. After business tool or before business tool. Okay, one UA action requirement, one business tool requirement. Correct? Now you got it. Yes, sir. Yes. Now third one. Huh? Yes, sir. Huh. Everyone, third one. Adding a user to group. What is the step? So I assign this ticket to you. Go to the production. Add the user to group. Close the task. That's it. 
it needed add it yes, in test and dev also export it and import it okay then finally add a field on the okay x application so just say application name is instant application i want to add a field on the instant application what you do we directly go to production and then create a field. same as this create now sir sorry ma can i go directly on a same production to and then create second. a field same and second so no sir it's a development right mm -hmm. so we need all this yes everyone understanding it understanding this one yes yes sir okay any questions on these four questions sir story creation is created by us our team members no someone will create or you can create also it depends on your it's it's your team activity if your architect will create an assign that is okay or if you can also create it if it is a simple thing Oh, we we can. We can, yes. yes. Okay. It depends on how okay, your okay. Uh, team is structuring. Okay. Okay. Good. Right now, are we understanding how we will be in life? Yes. Everyone. Yes or no? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, yes. So this part is very, very, very important point. you should be 100% clear here if you don't know this one even though you prepare or you practice all of them your pronunciations when you are answering na they will give you mismatch and then they will easily catch it up okay the first answer anusha garu answer na she was trying it but she now it's not our mistake okay it's my mistake only i'm telling okay so we so far explained everything like dev test prod dev test prod dev test prod okay and whenever we do something stlc process so she was 100% correct create a group validate it then move to test validate it move to prod validate it that is stlc process is only for developments here first task number 1 task number 3 are not developments so stlc process is not required here understanding my everyone yes yes so we should be very clear here when we are answering it okay small small things will make complex okay uh, we can say these are admin kind of uh, this one activities then they will ask what is admin activity what is not admin activity managing managing the groups and the roles and all those stuff we are 10 people we should in the production no ma actually the other way we are 10 people na we will do everything mm -hmm. so there is mm -hmm. no such you can tell okay. but until you don't face any cross questions you can tell if you are able to manage it okay. correct na ma okay. right so now in, instead of saying admin activities we can say support activities okay again here one more thing will come if i say admin then admin role will come am i right yes okay so now you all understood what is a task clear what kind of task we get it in service now am i right everyone yes no yes sir. yes okay good let's move on okay any questions on this particular part please raise ma any questions sir can we add can we add roles to a user or a group directly in production system we can add it's a data it's a data change not okay. to develop okay sir so that maturity also we need it ma okay for every activity that you do na you should know what it's a development or it's a data change correct yes, yes got you sir thank you okay so please uh, that's why we were practicing from day one that we are closely observing what is kind what is de what is development what is not development right so every time you open an update set and then start seeing it what is capturing what is not capturing na that is first thing 
there are few things okay where they don't capture by default you can't say like they are not developments let's say i have i given you to create a schedule job schedule jobs will not normally capture an update set you can't say like it's a data it's not a development that is specific to that topic but generally user creation group creation department creation okay data table data thing is not development understanding it yes so that kind of maturity also we need it so that's the reason you need to practice a lot 